Hey guys, this is Vatsalir from VS Tech and in this video, I will do a speed test comparison between the Nokia 7 Plus running on Android Oreo and the Nokia 7 Plus running on Android P. So both the smartphones have their latest software updates installed and both are connected to the same wireless network and there are no apps running in the background. So on the right side, we have the Android P version and on the left, we have the Android Oreo. So now let's start the speed test. One thing I have noticed is that the Nokia 7 Plus running on Android P has much slower transitions as compared to the Android O. Nokia 7 Plus on Android Oreo loads all the three games faster as compared to the Android P and also the transition speeds are definitely much slower on the Nokia 7 Plus running on Android P as compared to Oreo. So the Nokia 7 Plus on Android Oreo finishes the first round in 2 minutes and 19 seconds whereas the Nokia 7 Plus running on Android P finishes the first round in 2 minutes and 29 seconds. Now coming to the memory management round, I will open the apps in the reverse order to see the memory management of both of these devices and also both these smartphones have 4GB of RAM and 64GB of internal storage. Now in the memory management round, both the smartphones reloaded all the apps starting from Geo Music app. And on the Oreo device, the Paytm Mall app got crashed, so you can deduct this time from the Android P version. So we can deduct 5 seconds from the total time of the Nokia 7 Plus running on Android P. So 
both these smartphones reloaded all three games and due to the poor memory management of Nokia 7 Plus, both the smartphones took a lot more time to complete the second round. So the Nokia 7 Plus on Oreo completes the whole test in 4 minutes and 24 seconds whereas Nokia 7 Plus on Android P takes 4 minutes and 47 seconds considering that the Paytm Mall app got crashed on the Nokia 7 Plus running on Oreo. So the Android P on the Nokia 7 Plus is definitely worth a try and you can also install it on your Nokia 7 Plus if you want because I have been using this build for last 2 weeks and it is working very fine. Also I will be posting a dedicated review for this so stay tuned. If you did like this video don't forget to hit that like button and also share this video with your friends and family members who own a Nokia 7 Plus or who are planning to own one. So yeah that's it in this video thanks a lot for watching and I will see you in the next one. Thank you.